everybody, GeoArm Security here, and today we're going to show you how to program a Qualsys IQ key fob part number QS1331-840. Uh, this is an S-line key fob for the IQ panel 2, and we're going to show you how to program it uh, into the panel. So the first thing you're going to want to do is remove the key fob from its manufacturer's box, remove the installation and programming guide, and the actual S-Line IQ key fob. Keep all of the uh, boxes that, you, uh, that you're installing in resellable condition in case you have to return for whatever reason. And it's a good idea just to keep, uh, keep an eye on the installation and programming guide while we go through this video, just in case. Um, now, what you're gonna do is just go ahead and from the very top, you can slide down, select settings, advanced settings you can either either use the installer code which by default is 1111 or the default dealer code which is 2222 uh, I prefer the dealer code so 2222 now you're gonna select installation devices security sensors and you're going to auto learn the sensor um, you can see we already have the internal glass break activated, which we have a video on uh, showing you how to do that. Now simply, uh, you have about 120 seconds, so you're going to hold down the lock and unlock button for a few seconds, which is going to learn the serial number in. You want to select OK. Uh, sensor type, you want to change that down to key fob. Uh, key, sensor name, you can adjust that if you want. Uh, you can keep it at key fob or put a custom description, uh, which is very simple. Chime type, you're not going to need. Uh, mobile intrusion, which is by default is what you want it on. And you can see that it automatically picks up on the fact that it is an S-line key fob and not a regular, uh, an older style key fob. Now you're going to select add new. You can select the home button. And now, if you want to go ahead and arm the system stay, you would go ahead and hit the lock button. Key fob arm stay. And if you wanted to arm away, you hit it one more time. Key fob arm away. All right, and then disarm. Key fob disarm. And then if you wanted to actually have a panic button, you would just hold down the lock and unlock button. And you can see that we have successfully programmed the IQ key fob S-Line version into the Qualsys IQ Panel 2 wireless security and home automation system. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube page and click the show more tab underneath the video where you can view valuable links pertaining to this product, similar how-to videos, and our low-cost, no-contract alarm monitoring services.